morning, Saratoga High School. My name is Daphne Liu. And my name is Katie Wilson. Today is Thursday, September 22nd, 2016, and welcome to SHS TV. ASB and Sports Apparel will be on sale this Friday in the quad during the tailgate rally, lunch, and after school. Come and purchase some spirit wear for the new school year. Homecoming tickets are now on sale in the activities office. Ticket prices this week are $12 with ASB and $15 without. You must have your student ID with you in order to purchase tickets. Prices go up next week, so buy yours today. Club days today. Come out during lunch and see all the clubs Saratoga has to offer. Winter sports registration is now open until November 1st. You must pick up your ticket to play in the activities office before tryouts begin. If you're in a fall sport, you must wait until the season is over to pick up your ticket. This year, the number of freshmen in our school is unexpectedly large. We spoke to some teachers about the impact of this extra large group of ninth graders. So we have a large freshman class compared to the other classes who are here now and the ones that are coming uh, behind that. There are right around 340 freshmen, and as comparison, a point of comparison, there are 305 sophomores. So uh, the freshman class is disproportionately larger, but that's, that's a good thing. Uh, a lot of ninth graders who could have chosen to go to other schools, including private schools, chose to be here. Uh, to accommodate that larger class, we added a biology sex class section, which meant that we could um, put students in a new class, rearrange their schedules, and in total have a lower class average than we started with. The schedule change was a little awkward because I had to go from a new class with new people who I didn't know as well and I was just getting settled into my old classes. This year we had a huge biology class. Well, it, really all of our biology classes were enormous. Mine, I had 32. I even had a class of like 33, maybe even 34. It was just enormous. And I know that that was across the board with all four of our biology teachers. And luckily, because of the bond measure, we had enough money to go ahead and open up one more class of biology, which is phenomenal. We are so grateful to the community for doing this. My classes, um, one of my biology classes is 28, another one is 30, and another one is 31, which doesn't sound like a big difference. It's a huge difference. Man, math is getting way harder, and my brain hurts trying to remember which theorem does what. You don't have to worry anymore, Katie. There's a new tutorial center in the library that can help. So the tutoring center is located in the library, so you can stop by then uh, anytime between tutorial and 345, uh, odd and even days. The room was remodeled and installed over the summer, uh, and up until just the week before we opened, they were working on it. Um, we opened right after Labor Day weekend. And so right now we've mostly been offering peer tutoring. Uh, it just seems that's where the current interest is. So students who are interested in being tutored in a subject area just come by or email me to let me know uh, the subject area and when they're available. And then we will email the other students who've contacted us about being tutors uh, and try to set up a tutoring session for them. The girls volleyball team celebrated a great victory last Thursday, winning 3-0 against Milpitas. Our football team played impressively and won 42-27 against Lee last Friday. The field hockey team played against Cupertino and on Friday and won 2-1. Unfortunately, the boys water polo team lost 13-5 to Harker last Thursday. The MAP Speakers Series kicks off tonight in the McAfee at 6 p.m. Here's a look at what to expect from this free event. With homecoming around the corner, here's a look at next week's events. Are you ready for homecoming? Because I am!
Happy birthday today to Eric Bear. That's all we have for you today, Falcons. Thanks for watching SHS TV and have a great day.